Hi everyone, I'm Kyle Lyon. I'm a pre-sales engineer here at Solutions PT. And in this video, I'm just going to show you quickly how to get your information and your tag data from SciTech up into the cloud into Aviva Insight. So essentially we're going to be going over an architecture, a little bit like this, where you have SciTech at the bottom, going through the Insight publisher, up through the firewall and into Insight. So to prep your SciTech uh, application, what you need to do is you just need to enable something in the INI. So if I go into Setup Editor here, you can see here I've got the CT API. So if this isn't in the dropdown list, you can actually uh, specify it here. Just type CT API as you see it here. And you need to set a status remote equal to one. And that will enable the uh, exporting of the data into Insight. Additionally, what you'll need to do is you'll need to download the SciTech SCADA connector, which is a free download from within Insight. And what that will do is you just put that onto your SciTech node. So I've got that installed, so I'm just going to open that up very quickly. And what it's done is it's opened in my system tray. So what I can do here is I need, first need to prep which server I'm going to be sending data from. And I can set a standby if needed, but for the purposes of this, I'm just going to keep it as a primary. So for me, it's localhost. I specified a username and password that's um, authorized to be able to export that data. You'd set it up in your, in your server credentials. And then for destination, I'm going to select Insight Cloud. I'm going to direct all my data to Insight. And it's going to check that your SciTech SCADA license is valid. And then it's going to launch up the publisher. So within the publisher, you're just going to select the region that your Insight solution is hosted in. Mine's Europe. And then you're going to log in with your account. Now it's just going to check through and you can give your data source a name. So for the purpose of this, I'm just going to name it SciTech. Hit save and publish. And you can see that connection to Insight has now been registered. So I'm going to save that. And then you'll see that the SciTech SCADA connector is going to restart. It's going to disconnect and it's going to come online. So it's brought the SciTech connection online and the destination connection has been verified. So my SciTech application is currently in runtime. I'm just running the default demo application. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to open up my Insight solution. And then if I head into administration here, what I should see in data sources is that SciTech has been connected. We've got the last update a few seconds ago, so that connection has been established. And if I head onto the actual homepage, I can see that I can view some tags that are sourced from that SciTech data source. So let's pull a few tags out as a example. There we go. You can see that, and then you can, your data is up there and ready to be made uh, into pieces of content, things like trends, dashboards, graphics, all the things that Insight offers. So that's how easy it is to get data from SciTech up into Insight. Um, if you've got any further questions, do feel free to get in touch with us at Solutions PT, um, and have a good day.